Hello everyone and welcome to the latest edition of Trade Talk. My name is Andrew Swale and I've been classifying cows for 10 years now. Today I'm going to talk about perhaps one of the more glamorous traits that we assess, that of rear udder height. Any dairyman that milks cows will tell you that it's, they love to see their udders really high and wide and full in the morning, but there's a more functional reason, as with all the traits that we assess, about the welfare of the animal. As with all the linear traits, rear udder height is measured on a scale from one to nine, one being very low, nine being very high. An acceptable linear in this trait will be somewhere between five and seven. Picture one demonstrates a two-year-old heifer with a rear udder height linear of two. As you can see from the photograph, the mammary is being dragged forward between the back legs and underneath the animal. The heifer in the second photograph shows an improving picture. She has a rear udder height linear of five. Note how the mammary is beginning to be held behind the cow. The heifer in the final photograph demonstrates the ideal linear of seven. Note how the mammary has come out high and wide behind the animal. In conclusion, the health and well-being of the animal and the mammary is best served if it's carried high and wide behind the animal. Thanks very much for listening. Hope it's been of some interest to you and a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year to all the members.